The good news is real estate taxes for Loudoun County are lower for 2025. The bad news is you're still gonna be paying more for your taxes overall. Let's get into the details next. Hi friends and welcome back to our channel. Today we're gonna to talk about a really important and sometimes boring topic, personal property taxes. The Loudoun County Board of Supervisors have passed a $6.9 billion fiscal budget for 2025, introducing a real estate tax that may be lighter on paper but heavier in your wallet. The new rate is set at 86 and a half cents for every $100 assessed, which is down a cent from 2024. Sounds good, right? But there's a catch. First, let's start with the pros. A lower tax rate can make Loudoun County more attractive to potential buyers and investors, making it a more vibrant real estate market. Furthermore, if your home's value is appreciating, that's generally great news for your investment in the long term. Higher property values means more equity and the potential for higher profit should you decide to sell. Now it's time for the cons. While this may be all well and good for our equity and potential profit if we sell, just because the tax rate's lower doesn't mean your overall bill is going to be lower. In fact, the average homeowner will see about a $200 increase in their tax bill. Why is this? Well, because the values of the homes in our area, Loudoun County, have been on the rise over the last several years, therefore increasing the assessed value because the overall market value of the home has increased as well. So in essence, your lower tax rate is eclipsed by the rise in your property value. Shifting gears a little bit to personal property taxes, those have remained steady at $4.15 per $100 of assessed value. And to make matters even more interesting, pending legislation could allow for different rates to be charged for computer equipment than vehicles, lowering the burden on car owners next year. The upside, this offers a tailored approach to taxation, potentially lessening the burden for vehicle owners. The downside, it introduces complexity and unpredictability in your tax planning, making it harder to forecast your expenses. While the new tax rate may seem favorable at a glance, as always, the devil is in the details. The rise in property values introduces a double-edged sword because while your investment grows, so does your tax bill. And with the personal property taxes future hanging in the balance, staying informed and proactive with your financial planning is key. Let me know your thoughts about the tax changes and how it affects your family and maybe some strategies you're using to mitigate some of these changes. I know we can't stop our houses from appreciating, but maybe there's some other tactics that you're taking that you would like to share. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, and don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. We do new videos on living in this amazing Northern Virginia area every week. Thanks so much for watching. As always, your support allows us to do more videos like this on what it's like to live, eat, play, sleep, and dream in the Northern Virginia area. Take care and I'll see you on the next video.